What's going on guys? So as you can see the 55 is out, filled up with water. Took it down. That's a sad day. I got the 20. Took that down, sold all the corals out of it. Um, snowflake jumped out. That was a bummer. I was uh, actually going to donate it. I had a professor at a college um, nearby that was actually going to take it from me and put it in their system because they have a real big system, a bunch of systems actually. But anyway, no, I'm just kidding. I took this down. Well, I'm not kidding about the yellow or anything. I'm kidding about the tank of that tank. Tanking. Yeah, tank. Taking this tank down, I got something else. So, this tank is going to be used for that. So, let's go ahead and. I don't have a pause on this. So. I was going to use this, but I got some fixing to do and try to figure out what's up with this because it's leaking out of there too. But, okay. Shut the door. Bam. Oh. Can't stand as close with this. I got myself a 65. And I tell you what. If you are wanting a small, smaller size tank, <clears throat> but deep, I mean, and, and high, this is the way to go. I mean, this is 18 inches wide, so it's as wide as a 75. Um, it's three foot long, and then it's 23 to 24 inches high, depending on how you measure it, whatever. But yeah, I mean, this thing is so deep. I mean, obviously, I'm going to have to get a new light fixture for it, which I want to anyway because of... This is long. I mean, look at how long. I mean, this sticks over so far. I'm just going to have, like, a little end table there for my couch. Crappy phone that I just tried to take a video with. Um, I, basically, everything's running the same. I still got my canister filter down there. Then I'm just running filter media or filter floss. Um, well, other than that, the corals are doing good. This kind of tree ain't too happy, as well as back in there. I don't know if you can see that portion. Where am I at? Where's my finger? Right there. Ain't doing too well because in the 55, this bastard kept falling off and it fell off and hit this and hit this because these were on the same on the same rock um, so it's all stressed out but everything else is doing good I mean so I got the mushrooms of course the pulsing zinnias I got my little polyps in there my flower rock anemone Chilling there, I still got all the fish. You're right, mister. Um, you know, and I love this sand bed. It's such a deep tank, so I can really do what I want to do. Um, especially with putting corals on the sand. You know, get some plate corals, stuff like that. Um, and already this. My pulsing zine is trying to take over already. Look at there's broke off into its own piece of sand. I'm sorry, I'm, this this phone is horrible with taking videos. I mean I'm standing six foot away just to get this on screen. This camera sucks. But so yeah, I got my 65. I am super happy with it. Like I said. It is Uh, I'm just in love with it. It's made by Oceanic. Or Oceanic, however you want to pronounce it. I can get it to Oceanic, I guess you could say. I don't know. I started reading. 
But I really like the way they did the molding because it's not just flat. There's actually a curve to them, which is nice. Um, it gives the tank a much appealing look to it. A better appealing look to it. Um, but plans for this now, get a new light, and there are some more PP4s, one on each side, and I'll show you, uh, still got this tank, it's still, well yeah of course it's still got this tank, but I still haven't ordered the light yet, I'm bouncing around what light fixture I'm going to get for it, but as if you can see in the bottom there, it ain't going to... Focus, of course not. Let's see if I can see. No, of course not. Anyway, in the middle of that little frag are two little A cans. Um, I got them from my local um, fish store. Um, it was actually, I only paid five bucks for that little thing, which I don't know if it's a good deal. I don't know exactly what kind it is. But, so yeah, the only other thing is I cleaned up, oh, fast. Cleaned up the inside. I, uh, toggled the light. Oh, flash some light here. This is actually like a car light for, like, the underglow for cars that had laying around. Um, I got right on the toggle switch and then I mounted the wave maker controller on the side there. Um, and then back is the dimmer, which when I get this new light, this is all gonna go. None of this is gonna be in here. So, um, yeah, I got the wires ran outside, they're all tucked back here. But you can't see it anyway. What, Mr. What? Because of, you know, my desk. It's sitting right there. So. Yeah, yeah. You gotta get your opinion. Yep, yeah, yeah. Alright, all right, guys. I know it's been a while since I made a video of anything. I'm sorry. I, I got a new job and it's just... I'm on a call... 24/7, so um, you know I'm trying to do my best as I can with my pictures or my videos here. I know it's been a while. These freaking zinnias, dude, are just overtaking everything. This was a beautiful rock of polyps. Not anymore. Polyps back there. I'm gonna probably have to relocate them. They're coming out really nice. I like they, I like them. You know, they're not crazy looking, but. I gotta get something to get rid of those. Not good. I never noticed them before. So, yeah, it looks like it's dirty, but these are actually scratches. How they scratch these glass is beyond me. But, anyway. Alright, let me know what you guys think. I know I'm dragging this video on, and this phone sucks to take videos in general. Um, I can't use my GoPro anymore because it's garbage. No vocal anyway. Good for underwater shots. That's about it. Alright, let me know what you guys think. You guys have a good one.